What up? What up? What's up? What's going on? How you doing? Hope you're doing well. Hope you're doing fabulous. I just came on here real quick because I just wanted to talk to y'all about this Remy Ma, Nicki Minaj, Foxy Brown battle triangle that they got going on. Look, let me tell you something. At the end of the day, there's room out here for everybody. Get that off. Get that off. Get that off. There's room out here in this rap game, in this money game, for everybody. So, why is it that we feel we have to pit the females up against each other, but we got all these rappers that are male that are that somehow managed to if if it is a beef it's squashed like that why why are we dragging this out really like i don't understand it like i'm 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 to the point where i'm trying to wonder if we as a society are part part to blame for this um because hip hop is a predominantly male driven testosterone driven industry and I don't know if we just like to see females go at each other and tear each other down and instead of lifting each other up. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I, I just, it's just really sad and disappointing to me personally. Um, because as you all know, I am nay fan, no fan of no motherfucking Nicki Minaj. I never liked her, never will. But I do believe as a rapper that you all should be able to get along because all y'all at the end of the day that are egging these motherfuckers on uh, on Twitter like uh, they have their coins do you have yours you understand what I'm saying so at the end of the day cut the shit out because you know beefs and battles can turn deadly and it's really not that serious 16 bars versus 6 feet which one do you prefer 16 bars six feet under that's up to you but um i just think it's really ridiculous i really do i, I really do and now here come foxy brown with her ass throwing her little two cents up in this bullshit come on now just leave it alone let the shit die down who gives a fuck if if Nicki minaj doesn't respond who gives a fuck like just know that Remy Ma killed it, killed her, buried her dead, dead at the issue, and that was it. That Remy Ma, to be honest with you, there was really no need to even come out with a second one. Because the first one, pretty much six feet under dead, coffin, casket, burial, eulogy, that's it. So the second one was mm, Foxy. You know, we, we know you have to have some type of relevancy in this, this whole situation to try to get your little 15 minutes, but just just leave it alone. Enjoy your baby. You just had a baby. Enjoy that moment. Come out with some new music um, because there's still a foxy following out there. So that's what you need to focus on. If y'all motherfuckers focus on your music as much as y'all focus on what the next chick is doing, then you would be probably on the fucking charts right now. Whether it be Billboard, Hot 100, uh, BET. Bitch, y'all remember BET Countdown? I'm aging myself, I know. Y'all remember that countdown? Hmm. I miss my music videos. I used to come home from school. Yo, how many of y'all remember um, Video Music Box? All my New York heads. I know you know what I'm talking about. Video Music Box with DJ Ralph McDaniels. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But anyway, y'all, cut the shit out. It's, it's not worth it. It's not that serious. You know, it's, it's, it's room in this industry for everybody. So stay in your lane. Do what you do. Stop getting in other people's lanes, swerving, mixing. No. Stay in your lane. Do what you do. Anyway, peeps, I love you and get it together. Mm-hmm.